<sighs> well, Ben, this is a cheap date. Well, you, uh, you know, Vicky, sometimes I like to, uh, go to the park and uh, eat the ducks, if you know what I mean. Oh, I know what you mean. You like to throw the breadcrumbs towards the pond and hope that a duck of your liking will come and take a nibble. Mmm, well, you know, those, uh, ducks, they like the bread because it's so, like, fluffy and chewable. Oh, you satisfy the duck's natural urges. Oh yeah, I do. But, is that a snail? Is what a snail? It's looking right at you. boyfriend crying in the hall. Dr. Renfield, what were those marks on that poor girl's face? Those were the effects of a rat lungworm. <laughs> You won't be bothering me with the stress of daily life and current events. Who, or what, could that be? Well, aren't you the cutest little slimy thing? Would you like some Zinfandel? So, what can be done to stop these, uh, wormy things? Oh, you mean rat lungworm? <laughs> yeah, those things. Well, that, Dr. Willard, is a bit of a mystery. But why do they call it rat lungworm if the parasites come from snails? The original rat lungworm came from Asian rats. It soon moved on to slimier carriers. But what can stop them? Doesn't salt kill snails? Yes, but then the rat lungworm would just move on to another carrier. Another snail or perhaps a bird. Hmm. But what about alcohol? Perhaps we could get the parasites drunk. No! Well, excuse me, Dr. Renfield. Did I say something wrong? Excuse me, Dr. Willard. It's just that Rat Lungworm thrives on alcohol. In fact, alcohol can cause the Rat Lungworm to multiply. Oh, you mean like the Greeks? Yes, just like the Greeks. The Greeks? Yes, you know your ancient history. Okay, but what can we do to stop them? 
You mean the rat lung Oh my god, Dr. Renfield, there's been two more incidents, a junk man and a woman. What was her name? Velvita Coldcuts. Velvita Coldcuts? That's a weird name. Not as uncommon as you might think. Velvita Coldcuts is not an uncommon name? Nein! You see, the Scandinavians... Okay, okay. Enough about that. How are we going to defeat the, uh, parasites? You mean the... Yes! Don't say it. I have a plan. There is a new drug in development called Deoxychloroshnal, which can defeat the evil culprits. But we need bait. Why are you looking at me? Because you, Dr. Willard, will sit upon the same bench that Ben and Vicky sat upon. And then the slithery nemesises are bound to meet you there. But you will be ready. Ready for what? Ready for the attack of the Rat Lungwar! La, 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 la. Just sitting here enjoying nature. Ah, here's a new little friend. But it looks to me like your diet could use a little salt. And your wormy friends could use a little spray down. Yes. We've done it, Dr. Renfield. Yes, we've defeated the scourge of the rat lungworm. Rat lung worm, it's the worm that comes from snails. It never fails, not the rat lung worm. Rat lung worm, they shoot from the antennas. They're quite a menace. The rat lung worm. Rat lung worm. Rat lung worm. <laughs> Brought to you by... She was actually twins.
I'll be back.